Now we'll talk about the thing because of which we decided to shoot this video. Here's the stand up turn down color and now we're going to make several colors for you to understand how to do it. Today I'm not going to fit the dress, attach the frill. Today we'll only work with the color. Look how perfectly our dress is constructed. The neckline, the shoulder seam, everything is good. The back center, the neckline, the front center line, here's the shoulder, let's cut it out. Draw any color you want. I draw this one just as an example, you don't need such color. It doesn't matter if the edges are square or round, it's not the case. Here's the color, look at it. I want you to see all the details. Absolutely flat color, which follows the form of an item. Nothing similar to the stand-up turn-down color. A good color, but absolutely flat. It's not standing here, you see? Have a look at it, please. What should we do for it to become a stand-up turn-down color? Let's continue working. Cover the shoulder for about one and a half centimeters, so three centimeters altogether. The fabric is too strong, but I need to finish this lesson if I've already started it. Here, the important fact is that the angle changed. Now do the same thing we did first time. This part is kind of closed a bit, you see? So we have another opening here now. Let's draw the neckline. It has another form now. Again, you can draw any color you like. Have a look here. That's our new neckline. We got it when we closed the shoulder a bit, for about 3 cm. So here is our new neckline. See how much it differs from the first one? Here is our first line, when the color was flat. And that's how it changed due to the fact that we closed the shoulder a bit. It won't always be that hard, you don't have to work with such a strong fabric. So I'll show you some more variants. Take the pins out, open the dress and put it on, on our dummy. Here is our first color, absolutely flat. Here is our second color. It already has a bit different form, a bit stand up, turn down. Due to the fact that we closed the shoulder before drawing the neckline, it changed the form. And we are going to make one more color now. Many people know how to make a flat collar and how to make a stand up turn down collar without any patterns or the photos in the magazines. I'll teach you. Look, it has another form now. 
because it stands out a bit. It's already a bit stand up, turned down. And now let's close our shoulder for 5 centimeters. Pin it here. Now you'll see how differently looks our neckline after closing the shoulder. The neckline is absolutely different now, we can't lay it out any other way. Notice that I don't even try to do it thoroughly. I just want to show you the technique. So the first collar is absolutely flat. The second is slightly stand up, turned down. And here's the third collar. It's stand up, turned down, you see? Here it's flat, and the middle stands out. So we turned our flat collar into the stand up, turned down. You know why I show you that? For you to know how to do it without the pattern. Imagine you want to make a collar, but you don't have a pattern, so you can't do it. Such colors are in trend now, on any colors. White colors are often made on the dark clothes, then the lace is put around, small bows. You can put a brooch here. So I showed you how to do it. Firstly, prepare the neckline, then close the shoulder, lay out the neckline with the closed shoulder, draw the first line and construct the line from it. That's how you should get a stand-up turn-down collar. I wanted to show you how to do such colors, but you should understand that the form can be different, angled, round, any form. You should know how to do a neckline, and from it you can construct any color you want, of any width. This color is 7 cm wide in the middle, you can make it bigger, smaller, doesn't matter. If you follow my instructions, it will always look good. In the next video we'll continue working with this dress, and I'm glad that today I showed you how to work with the colors. Have a good day. We are Bauksterina Mikhailovna and Yastrybov Alexei. Goodbye.